First off, let me say congratulations to the graduating class of this year. You did it. You made it. 12 years of academics have led you up until this point right here. You're about to walk across a stage, a football field, somewhere, and get you a diploma. Best thing that's probably ever happened to you in life. The biggest moment of your life so far other than being born. So let's break it down. I'm going to try and keep it under three minutes. You've got some options here. Option number one, most obvious option, you go to college, get a four-year bachelor's degree. It's going to run you about 36000 42000 somewhere in that range, depending on where you go and where you stay at, whether it's on campus, an apartment, or at home with your parents or whoever. Then you've got a technical school, trade school, something like that. Average cost, about $10,000. Average course time, 18 months. Okay, so you see these two things here. Depending on the degree you get and depending on the trade you get, you're either going to owe $40,000 or $10,000 and you're gonna make the same amount of money after that course. So you either make the same amount of money after four years or make the same amount of money after 18 months, okay? Those are two options that involve school. School's not for everybody. School wasn't for me. I chose to go into the workforce. The workforce option, in my opinion, is the best option and the one I hope most of you take because if you go into the workforce, you have the option to go to a trade school or college later on and have money to do so. So the workforce is simple and easy. Go out there, you get a job, not a great job in the beginning, you learn a skill set, you get better at it, and you get paid more. A lot of people that I've worked with in my career so far, they've gone to college or they have gone to trade school, and I make the same or a dollar less than them. Some places I've made more because I've had more years of experience. So just remember, whatever you want to do in life, make sure it's what you want to do because it's going to be your life, not your parents, not your school counselor or anything like that. You need to make a choice that benefits you in the long run. And remember, the workforce option is the easiest because you can change your mind at any time and you don't have any debt. Option one and two, college and trade school, you're gonna have a lot of debt and a whole lot of interest and that shit's higher than Snoop Dogg on 420. So make a good choice. And if you don't know what you wanna choose, don't choose yet. You've got your whole life. Take your time. Have a good one. Look into stuff. Don't be forced into an option. Again, congratulations on graduating.